man, you know, it was that team of North Week 2022, and, uh, a lot of people have questions about Jackson. So I'll just give an update on them. So right now, they came out with a, an updated mock draft of, you know, for 2023. And they have Jackson going 21st overall to the Chicago Bears, you know, an upcoming draft. And he hasn't really played that much this year. He hasn't really been healthy. And that is a projected first round pick as well. Uh, it's been reported that last week, so the, the game is this week. It was reported last week that if Jackson plays in the Maryland game, you can most likely expect him to play in the game against that team up north. But if he doesn't play in the Maryland game, it's unlikely that you'll see him play in a game against that team up north. And then there's some reports that are saying that if Ohio State was to to make the college football playoff, he would then, you know, come back in January and, and play in that game. We've seen in the past, especially recently, you know, players go down. You know, we've seen Jamison Williams go down. He was still a, a high pick. Uh, I think who was Jalen? Was it not Jalen Waddle? Another, you know, receiver went down, you know, late in the season and was still a high pick. If I'm Jackson, I, if I'm a projected first round pick, now all that's not always true for every single site. But if I'm a projected first round pick, I don't see him coming back to to play for Ohio State. You know, if he does play, you know, give it a go. I would be very shocked. Um, I think that team up north is probably gonna be prepared. They're gonna have something, you know, just in case he does play. And I think. If he plays, you have him alongside Marvin. I would love to see that. It's unfortunate that we have, you know, been a Buckeye fan and alum, that we didn't get to see that. I wish we got to see Chase Young and Nick Bosa play. You know, that's how life works sometimes. You don't get to see it. And I don't think he's going to play in the game against that team on North. Now, if he was to, to play, I would be shocked. If he ever plays for the Buckeyes again, whether it's this week, potentially Big Ten Championship, potentially the College Football Playoff, I would be very shocked, especially – you know, now they have him as a projected first-round pick going to the Chicago Bears, which they need all the help they can get. Justin Fields needs, needs more, you know, talent around him. But if he's, a, in fact, a projected first-round pick, I, I see no reason why he's going to suit up for the Buckeyes, especially if he's not 100%. I think he'll probably sit this game out and maybe potentially the rest of the, of the, 